Suicide training begins within the mind, although it's not entirely certain how it got there in the first place. Some skeptics believe that it is not inside the mind at all, but within some other alternate form. And some people do not believe that this is true. Others believe simply that suicide training is not existent in certain circles. And sometimes people like to debate whether, whether, let me compose myself here, whether suicide training is practical or really ineffective. Uh, that's not a proper use of the terminology, I don't understand. Uh, <clears throat> <sighs> <sighs> suicide training being began in space and ran into the Mars cluster of the solar system where some people believe that suicide training did not occur for the first half of the millennia, but the third millennia within the second age of the space became the future of suicide training. There they had the ground spacecraft with their various training vessels and training modules and they would train in zero gravity and they would train in extra gravity but it was kind of stupid because they died anyways and many people died during suicide training before they were able to accomplish their actual suicide. Many were murdered in an attempt to prevent them from committing suicide. Others were merely sent into a state of uh, stasis where they will be uh, 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 frozen in suspended animation for around 3,000 years where they will then become defrosted and uh, 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 thawed out so that they may continue to receive their suicide training until they can commit suicide at the appropriate date and sometimes they don't feel that it is necessary to commit the suicide after the suicide training has begun. Sometimes people they do not receive the full training that is necessary for them to commit suicide. They uh, are half trained in suicide and then they can commit half suicide uh, many times, often just severing limbs and then rest, thus rendering them uh, unable to complete the suicide training later on because they are limbless and unable to kill themselves. Uh, in this case, many times they are murdered by a friend at their own request, but this again is not suicide. This is assisted suicide, which is a very different thing. And uh, oftentimes, the uh, the unskilled that is the best that they can hope for is to uh, attempt assisted suicide, in which another person is uh, uh, not entirely unlike seppuku, where it is uh, they're executed at the, the hands of themselves the best that they can, with the finishing blow delivered by another individual at a later time, in a way that is more effective for them to uh, uh, be dead.